my cosplay is uh, Goddess Madoka from Puelli Magi Madoka Magica. Um, it's based off a uh, more concept art than the actual poofy cupcake version of her uh, costume from the show. I can't really remember exactly how long it took for me to actually sew this. Um, lots of hours after work. I think it took probably um, around five weeks for me to get it completed, working a few hours a day. Um, the universe fabric I actually spray painted myself, uh, did splatter paint on it to get a starry look for it. Um, and then all the ruffles, it was my first time really making any ruffle costume at all, so that was a really interesting experience. <laughs> My wings are made out of a tool that I spray painted to have a sort of um, ombre effect, pink going into white. Um, then they're laid out over wire, so that gives them a little bit more structure. And um, the individual pieces are held up by thread, so it kind of gives the illusion of being individual feathers. I've been cosplaying since the KatsuCon 2012. Um, that was my first time cosplaying. I did uh, Princess Garnet from Final Fantasy IX. I did her white ball gown. It was my first cosplay. I'm still pretty proud and impressed that I was able to get that done. Um, I've been attending conventions since 2011, so as soon as I hit the scene, I knew that I wanted to start cosplaying, so that was something that I jumped right into. Um, I've done uh, Rapunzel in the past. I have done a lot of cosplays from the Tales of video game series from Bandai Namco. That's one of my favorite series, and so I always love cosplaying from it. Being here at Ellicott City, it's it's been a really wonderful experience because I've met so many people that I haven't had a chance to meet and worked with photographers that I really admire and I'm really glad that I'm finally able to meet the person behind the work that they produce um, and seeing all the amazing cosplayers and meeting everyone it's just been a really wonderful experience getting to know all these amazing and talented people. I really love cosplay as a hobby. It's been kind of therapeutic for me to be able to craft something and make something with my own hands. So that's something that I really appreciate about the hobby and just everyone that I've met in this community has been so supportive and everyone has been so great and everyone in this hobby and, and the photographers and cosplayers have so much talent and and so much potential to realize and i just think it's it's an amazing thing that we create as a community <laughs>